So Sessions is out, and an Iowan is taking a seat at the top of the Justice Department in Washington. Iowa native Matt Whitaker is taking over in an acting capacity until a new nomination is made. Angelina Salcedo has a report for us tonight on that new attorney general and what he has done to make himself available for that job. Always fight for Iowa. From playing for the Iowa Hawkeyes. Hey! To running against Republican Senator Joni Ernst. I'm incredibly excited to have the people of Iowa speak. Matt Whitaker has done it all. Matt is a consummate politician. He always has been and always will be, I think. Um, he knows how to you know, slap you on the back and tell you what a great guy you are. Um, he has the ability to communicate on that level. His Iowa background is extensive. The Hawkeye played in the Rose Bowl in 1991. Then he began his law career and was appointed as a U.S. attorney in 2004. He ran for senator in 2014, became the chief of staff for Jeff Sessions in 2017, and now he's interim attorney general. It does surprise me that, uh, that Trump would have picked him over probably a number of other individuals. His strength is on the political side. He clearly is ingratiated, ingratiated himself with the President of the United States. Whitaker's power isn't different than any other Attorney General. He could end any investigation the DOJ is doing, including the Mueller investigation, if he chooses not to recuse himself. It could be a situation where um, Trump is thinking, okay, I've got my guy, uh, I'm going to appoint him, I'm going to let him take over the, the Mueller investigation and, uh, and terminate it. All right, now Whitaker is just the acting attorney general. Still unclear how long he'll be in that position, but as long as the president is happy with him, Riggs tells us that Whitaker will be there until someone new is finally nominated.